I don't know what crap they put in this product right here, but you need it, sis. I ain't gonna lie to you, sis. You need this. video and yes I am giving you guys the first video of Women's History Month I'm so excited so today I am giving you a feminine hygiene routine and product Bible so that's what we're gonna be doing today it's gonna be a lot of products a lot of chat and a lot of like girl to girl stuff keep watching this video make sure you like this video subscribe if you're not subscribed I don't understand what's going on here because but yes, y'all, make sure you follow me on all of my social medias at Amber Valen. That's going to be on Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, and Facebook. So yeah, there's going to be cars rolling by because I'm on a main street. But if y'all cool with that, I'm cool with that too. So yeah, let's just get right into the video because it's going to be a lot. Okay? Okay, so I am standing up right now just because I wanted to do a stand-up video. I haven't done them at all. And in my opinion... I think I look a little better, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think I look a little better. No, I got hella energy right now, and it's honestly because I have been drinking this Teamy Tea. I've been drinking the morning one. I drink the cola one later tonight, but I just start trying this stuff out, y'all. They did reach out to me, and they wanted to work with me, and honestly, I was in the mood for some March Madness, some Melanin March stuff, because I'm going to be a flat tummy girl. I'll tell you that. There's a whole schedule for me on this, so I'm really excited to try this. My coupon code is VALEN20 or VALEN15. If you guys are interested in trying some stuff from Teamy, you can try it too, okay? Right. Yes. Let's go ahead and dive into our categories. First one's going to be Body Sensation, okay? Body Central. That's what that one's going to be. And the last category is probably what you're going to be here for. I'm going to name it Product Bible because honestly, who would have known that I would have so much stuff from my private area? All right, so let's dive into category one. Boom, let's go. Let's start with my shower stuff just because, like, I know, like, Y'all want to see that stuff too, and these are just my favorites I've been loving. Like, this has been my routine for the past two months, so honestly, lately in the shower, I've been really loving my Hemp's Milk and Honey Herbal Body Wash. As you can tell, <laughs> I've really been using this stuff like, y'all, this is my favorite. I don't know what it is. It works with a loofah, it works with hand scrub, it works with a little silicone pad. It literally works with everything. It's really good smell on me. I really love this stuff. Y'all should check it out. The next products I'm gonna mention are from Soap and Glory. I did the, I got this stuff in my little haul that I did for body, I think it was last year. But I really like this stuff. Like when I tell y'all the scent is dead on, like I literally can't even like, I don't know what I was doing without these products, I'm not gonna lie. Let me tell you what these are. This is the Soap and Glory Smart Foam Shower Mousse and the scent is Original Pink. It's fruity and floral, smells like an old time, a classic Hollywood scent that I'm really a fan of. Um, the next product is going to be the Soap and Glory. It's more of like a grapefruity smell. I really like these two products and they will continue to be in my routine, honestly. Products I'm gonna talk about are from Tree Huts. These scrubs I got in my haul as well, but I've been loving these. Like I've been using them almost every shower and I don't shower every day so so yeah these are my favorite scrubs at the moment I do have another scrub to show you guys actually let me get it out I have this one from Hems. um it's more moisturizing than these I would say because it's more milky I really like the scent it really gives me hotel vibes so when me and Bae go on hotel I bring this because it just makes me feel like I'm on a resort, you know? I don't know. You gotta smell it to try it, but these are the scrubs I've really been loving. I use these products for under my arms or like any detoxifying area on the body that I want to detoxify. But as you guys know, I've been natural for like three or four years now. So my armpits are more sensitive some days than others. So for that, I use the Mega Babe Underarm Detoxifying Mask. I really like this stuff. I think whenever I switch the orders and try new stuff, my arm has a, my armpits have like a reaction. So this calms it down, detoxifies it, like kind of like gets that deodorant out of my system faster than it would in a wash, you know, just washing over it. Like this like brings the stuff forward and I really like this. I really like the applicator too. It's really e easy to use in the shower. I really like this stuff. You should try it out. It's at your local Ulta and I don't think it was that expensive and I had to got it on a sale. So like literally try this out and see how you like it. The next product is from Sweet Labs and this is just an exfoliating brightening pad. I use it around the bikini area and I use it on my armpits too because those are darker areas that I exfoliate a lot and I just want to make sure I'm brightening them overall. 
So this is something that I use in the shower though so that I can rinse it off like after I'm done with like my whole routine. Next products that I've been loving in my routine lately are these scrubs and the silicone pad. I use this right before I get in the shower to like brush and like exfoliate my skin to make sure those dead skin cells are lifted and ready to just wash off my ass, you know? <laughs> but yeah, I have this little pad too. I've been really liking this like in softer areas. So like under my armpits, I've been using them around bikini area just to exfoliate a little bit, you know? And it holds soap really well too. So I don't know, I really like this. And of course, I got this one off of Amazon. I'll have all the links down in the description box for you guys to all find everything that you need to find. Okay, okay, so you guys know I've been natural for a while. If you guys want me to do like a natural deodorant video, I can do one because I have literally like 25 deodorants that I've been using over the last couple years. I want me to like put a video together of that, let me know because I can. But I have a whole bunch of deodorants in my hand right now, so I'm just going to show you a couple that I like. Um, I've tried this Mario Badescu one. You have to apply twice a day with this one, but I still like it in the sense pretty neutral, pretty clean. I tried this. This is the Pure Vanilla Natural Formula, the Healthy Deodorant. And this is the one in lavender. This one's okay too. Um, I found that I had to apply once sometimes, maybe twice sometimes, but it wasn't too bad. Now my favorite is probably going to be the one from Dove. It has zero aluminum in it, which for the most part, like, it has zero aluminum. Which is why I went natural, because I didn't want aluminum in me. So yeah, I really like this. This is my all-time fave. I can apply this once and literally be good for the entire day, and I really like that. But I'll show you guys in a video if you guys want, like, what my actual routine is for that. Like, how do I stay smelling good while being natural? Because I promise y'all, you would never think that I'm natural at all. Okay, so next I'm going to mention sunscreen because a lot of people forget about sunscreen but that should be in your routine too so like on the really hot days i'll put on the hydro boost one i really like this one specifically because it's very moisturizing it doesn't leave me with a cast or anything like i still look like a baddie you know what i'm saying so you need some sunscreen in your routine so that's what i've been doing in my next i'm going to mention some, some of my favorite lotions at the moment and they're both from hymns i've really been using this hymns milk and honey one of course i love this one too because i have the body worse I can't talk. I have the body wash and I really like that one. Next I have this Hemp Sugarcane and Papaya. This is a limited edition one. I got it around the holidays when I filmed my little haul like last year but I really like this scent y'all. Like this stuff makes me feel like Candyland and this makes me feel more warm and cozy at home. So they're two different vibes for two different reasons because I literally go back and forth between which vibe I'm in. The last product of Body Sensation is going to be for the mouth, for the teeth. It's going to be Moon Cosmetics. I think this is Kendall Jenner's line. She makes toothpaste stuff. Just a pen I've been using and I put it on for 30 seconds. It really does make a difference. It really does. I'm going to put it on right now, actually. Can you see it? I got toothless shit on too. Okay. 30 seconds. I'll do that. Alright, it's done. It's off. Can you tell? Y'all can tell. Stop playing with me. You know what's going on with me? Because y'all already know I got a little energy. You know y'all nerves. Hold on. Let me chill out. Okay, so we're bumping into the last category, which is product Bible, product vagina, whatever. I don't know what we named it, but let's just get into it because it's, it's a decent amount, you know? Start with shaving and washing and all the good stuff already. Okay, we diving right in. So the first two products I have are from Tree Hut. This is the Shave Prep Sugar Scrub, and this is the Coconut Life Moisturizing Shave Oil. When I tell y'all, the best I've ever used in my life. This is all I use for shaving now. I don't know what crap they put in this product right here, but you need it, sis. I ain't gonna lie to you, sis. You need this. Thank me later. I ain't saying nothing else. I ain't saying a dang thing because this right here has saved my life. This is the award of the year for me. But yes, y'all need this in your life. I'm gonna move on to the washes. Okay, so let's move on to washes. The first wash that I fell in love with, I'm not gonna lie, is from Target. And this is the Down There Wash from Good Wash. It's almost out, y'all. I've used this entire bottle to the... Ride or die. They got different scents and different ones. They're all good for your vagina. Don't be scared to use a vagina wash, y'all, because they're literally for that. And then the next line that I've been using is from Honey Pot Company. I know y'all seen this around in every girl's little feminine hygiene video. Like, this is the, the light of the show, but I got a lot of lights in my show. Thank you. This is Honey Pot Company. I got the sensitive and the normal. I swap back and forth depending on when my period's coming because, you know, sometimes mama could be a little more sensitive. You know what I'm saying? Try this stuff out. I think you'll really like it, sis. It's going to change your vagina game for real. You know what I'm saying? Okay, the next thing I'm going to talk about are vagina supplements. So, I have the... Love and Wellness of this brand. I have the pro the Good Girl Probiotics and I have the UTI, I don't think so. I have 
haven't had to really take the UTI, I don't think so. This is just for like just in case. But I have been taking the Good Girl Probiotics for the last month and I really like it. But before that, I was taking the Nature Bounty, the Probiotic 10. So like I don't need anything this strong anymore. But back in the day, I did need something strong because I didn't properly know how to take care of myself. So I'm using the Good Girl Probiotics. These are a little less than this one, which is perfect for me because I don't need too much right now. Like I'm pretty, I'm, I'm pretty good, you know what I'm saying? But like this is a little stronger than these probiotics. So these are options for you as far as supplements to help, you know, save your life. Okay, now we're going to talk about suppositories and all the fun stuff that really like gets you ready overnight. First thing I'm going to talk about is from Nutriblast and this is the Borg Life Intimate Health suppositories, blah, blah. You know, I'm pretty sure you guys have heard about these already these things work these things are the truth you it says you can use them for up to a certain amount of days but I find that I only need one and I'm good I don't really need them as much and when I do use them it's because I know I ate something crazy or I know I'm really stressing so that's when I'll really take these they do come with suppository applicators mine are completely empty because this is one of my first packs i've been using for the, like, the last couple of months this look like a little tampon insert i was about to see if i wanted to go in the bathroom and actually grab it for y'all this set also comes with a feminine hygiene ph test strips and still in aluminum foil you basically take it out and you swipe under there and it gives you like the, the color of your ph and depending on what color that is it's either off or it's on and it'll tell me like hey girl you should probably take one of these okay. i got this from ulta and this is the killer i have yet to try it but i'm pretty sure it does the exact same thing and the ratings on ulta's website are pretty high so i have good thoughts for this one all right next we have a couple different products and they're all different because all women are different I have some tampons, I have some pads, and I have the Diva Cup. Okay, these are all different alternatives. They all do different things. They all work different. You know, they're all different. So I'm going to start with pads. These are like my favorite pads to use. I always use the Always Radiant ones because I have like a light, clean scent on them. I don't know how it works. I don't know if that's really good for your vagina, but it's never caused any problems for my vagina. But I like these because they're big, they're thin, they're flexible, and honestly, they smell pleasant. The next ones are from Honey Pot. Don't get mad at the packaging because I messed this thing up. This thing will be with me for a long time. These are like, they're organic, they're fragrance-free, they're chlorine-free, plant-free, fem like feminine care tampons. They're good for your vagina. They're not gonna freaking blow up. I've used Diva, a Diva Cup before, but it was a couple years ago. I haven't bust this one open yet to try it, but these are just the options I go back and forth through whenever I have a period. So I'll do these three, and I'll decide which one I want to work with. I'm probably going to try this one out, honestly, again, my next cycle. The next couple of products are going to be like everyday products you should have because they're going to help your routine and your vagina maintenance go by way faster. So first, I have a bunch of stuff in my hand. Let me put some stuff down. Okay, the next products I'm going to tell you about are going to be from Honey Pot. This is a Honey Pot uh, panty spray. This is just a jasmine one, so like it's not going to be anything affecting your body. Of course, again, it's plant-based, fragrance-free, parabens-free, sulfates-free. This neutralizes odor and keeps you fresh. It refreshes and restores. It's going to do the job, guys. Try this out. Try this out. The next thing I say try from Honey Pot is their Soothing Lavender Vulva Cream. I put this on after I've shaved and it feels like I am raw almost. I need some moisture. Sometimes you get that clean of a shave. You know, I, I, that's what I've been getting these days. So I've been finding myself to put like a cream over it and this one smells like shea butter. It's made out of natural ingredients. So I really like this one. I really like the packaging too. It smells so good. It has a little mint in it, coconut oil, lavender, and it has the shea... Try this out, y'all. Y'all gonna like it, okay? I'll tell you, y'all gonna like it. Okay, the next product I got is Vagisil Odor Block. It's open, I think. No, it's not. No, it's gonna neutralize my smell, but it's gonna be more of a feminine version of that. So that's why I have this one. Of course, it's not that expensive, so I really like it. It's what I've been using. Okay, next I have some wipes. And these are just neutral, no scent wipes that I use to wipe whenever I'm like in between shifts or if I have somewhere to go real quick and I don't have time for a shower. I'm going to use my Summer's Eve fragrance free cleansing wipes. It's almost empty because I really do use these y'all and I use them not only for my vagina, like I use them for my armpits. Like I just do touch ups every now and then. I keep them in my purse whenever I go traveling. I'll have them in my, my bag. Like. This is just good to have. And I think it's only like two bucks or something. And I got mine off Amazon. So these are the perfect on the go wipes to have. Okay. I also have this bio oil. Obviously, it's almost gone because I use it all over my body, including my bikini area, because it. <laughs> 
this stuff helps with everything y'all it helps with stretch marks it helps with bumps it helps with discoloration it helps with moisture it helps with literally everything you know there's a whole bunch of stuff on here scarring anti-aging uneven skin tone like this stuff really works okay i really like using this every all of my body and i would recommend it i have the last couple of products i'm going to show in this video i swear i know we went crazy but this is a product bible for a reason i'm literally giving you all the juicy details this is the flamingo razor and um like the refills for the razor I can't talk right now guys I'm sorry but this is the flamingo one I like it but I feel like the head is a little too loose other than that it gives me the perfect shave a really clean cut shave and of course I have some backups another one that I like is from Bic I have a whole pack that I bought it wasn't that even it wasn't that expensive I like how skinny the razor is because a lot of them are super thick and I feel like I can't really cut corners and like really get in there if it's not super thick. So these are my go-to whenever I don't feel like messing with the Flamingo, you know, the real more expensive one. These are my go-to jams and I've been using them for years other than a men's razor of course but these come close. And the last two products I want to talk about are like some products that are like ooh. Okay so I have the Vanish PFB and this is the Chroma Bright one and I'm very excited because I've been using these for like three years now. I've been using these for a long time. I even was using them before Jackie Anna put me on to them. This stuff is really nice. It helps to peel and get rid of the old bumpy dark discolorated skin and reveal more of a clean brighter you know bikini area. So this is basically like a chemical peel for your vagina but like over time so like you'll see results within like your first two weeks of using this okay consistently you'll see results it'll start to peel a little bit almost like rush off you're gonna be getting good results the last product of this video is going to be something a little controversial I was debating like putting this in here because I haven't used it long enough to like get any results and I was like dang should I put this in here but yeah this is the intimate whitening gel it's from Amazon it has really good reviews and it's just supposed to lighten and even tone your bikini area so try it and see how you like it but yes this is my whitening cream and I have yet to see results yet but I'm working on it because I have to use that in exchange with this one like I can't use these both at the same time so that's why I've been a little slow getting around to this one but this one is amazing I'll give you guys a review on this whenever I do an updated or an in-depth general feminine hygiene video but yes that's gonna be it I'm gonna go ahead and dive right into the outro I'm gonna thank you guys so much for watching this video today I don't know if it's gonna be a long one or a short one but I just gave y'all all of the products that I've been using for the last couple of years and what my routine is. Don't take everything from this video, but I hope you took something from this video. I hope you try something out from this video. And if so, click any of the links in the description box and it should take you right where you need to be. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and follow me on all of my social medias at Amber Valen. And I love you guys. Happy Women's History Month. I'm so excited for this month to start. And yeah, happy Melanin March, babies. I'll see you guys in the next video.